executive committee of the Erie County Democratic Party making their endorsement for the next leader of New York's 26th district. Now, since November, questions have been circulating of who will fill the soon to be vacant seat of Representative Brian Higgins. Seven News political analyst Bob McCarthy maintaining that key player in making that decision is Erie County Democratic Chairman Jeremy Zellner. Now, so who is the most important person really in this decision making process? Jeremy Zellner, the Democratic chairman who looms as the kingmaker in this thing. That's because this is a Democratic district. There's 238,000 Dems in the district, only 107,000 Republicans. And so therefore, uh, whoever the chairman decides, basically as, as, as the main voice for the committee who makes this decision, whatever decision he makes sometime in January, will essentially uh, elect this Democrat against a vastly outnumbered Republican and give that Democrat a big leg up for the June primary, which anybody can enter then. Our Dawson in person here with Zellner and the Democratic Party's endorsement, as well as the impact of this decision on Western New York politics. The Erie County Democrats endorse Senator Tim Kennedy for the 26th Congressional District seat that will soon be vacated by U.S. Congressman Brian Higgins. The endorsement even brought tears to Kennedy's eyes as he passionately spoke about being a force for change for all Americans. This is a fight that will continue the progress that we've seen in our community, a fight to change the embarrassing dysfunction that we've seen for far too long in Washington, D.C. This is a campaign that will bring all people together, a campaign that will be bigger than any one person. Erie County Democratic Chairman Jeremy Zellner spoke on what he says was the right decision to endorse Senator Kennedy. We, we're losing a 20-year member of Congress and his clout in Washington. We need to replace that with somebody that doesn't need on-the-job training, somebody who's not a keyboard warrior, someone who's not going to embarrass this community by the you know, wild things that they say on social media. Uh, we need a leader, and we need somebody who has delivered already for this community. That's Senator Kennedy. It's, it's crystal clear uh, tonight that our committee was overwhelmingly supportive of him and unanimously supportive of him. For that very reason, among many others, you know, he understands what our community's needs are. He's out every single day. He, he's, he's throughout the community every single day, not just focused in one area. So um, it wasn't a really difficult decision today. Senator Kennedy emphasized his commitment to not leaving any Western New Yorker behind. That no one will work harder than I will for the people of every single part of the district that I represent, and I'm looking forward to getting to work. This isn't just about sound bites. This isn't just about popularity. This is about going to Washington. We get a lot of resources from the federal government here in Western New York, and we can't lose that. So having the senator as our endorsed candidate for Congress makes his seat even the more important for the Senate, because he has de a, almost a decade as the transportation committee there. New York State in America, this is your campaign. We are going to show the people across our nation extraordinary leadership and it starts here tonight in buffalo jocelyn person seven news